Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 12 of Let's Play Ratchet and Clank Up Your Arsenal. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, what exactly am I needed to be here for? I, I realize when I press select, I'm not going to the map anymore. Because this is my map. But what does this do? Can I not hack this? Or maybe I need something else. Hold on. Apparently that doesn't work. Repair the satellite laser links. Oh, I know what I need. I need the refractor. I haven't used this thing in a long while. Oh, okay. We're sorted now. Now, why do I need this laser? Oh, that's where the satellite is. Can I drop down safely? I mean, I should be able to. Oh, I almost landed on the one spot that had lava. Honestly, not a big fan of the camera in these areas. But I guess we'll make do. Wait, what's down there? I want to see what's over there. I can use a hyper shot here. I can also take out these idiots. So I will. on these platforms. Let me go take a look. Maybe I'll find a way to the next satellite. Even though it should be pretty obvious where it's to. God, it's it's terrible. Like it's always so close to me. And I don't like it being that close. Why do I feel like there's something around here? Like something I have to really look for. Oh, there's a cave! I didn't even notice that cave. Oh, I can't go that way. Why is that? Is that because I didn't use Hyper Shot before? I think that's what it was. Alright, let me try it now. Maybe now, if I go this direction, that cave should open? Yep, it's open! It worked! Good, 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 good. I figured it out. Now I need to figure out where to go next. Can you not? Oh, I forgot. I just went to the Annihilator now. Kinda didn't need to, but okay. I guess if I just take the high road, I might be able to find where the next satellite is faster. There's a whole bunch of asteroids. I missed every one of them! Maybe if I use an asteroid, I can get a good vantage point. Hold on. Would that be a skill point here? Get to the belt! Oh, like an asteroid belt! Okay, I notice I can't really just use my, uh... 
my slow descent when I'm uh, doing the jump pads. Oh, okay. I see how it is. It looks like there's only one specific uh, asteroid I can land on, and it's the one that's flat. Otherwise, you just fall right off. I'll have to try that again later. But for now, let's fix the satellite. And it looks like I gotta go up here. And indeed I do. Get out of here, you! Is it this thing? Yes. Alright, that's my next destination. Right there. Good enough. At least they have arrows to point where I need to head to. So I won't get lost. Now I gotta get up there. Can I get up there just using these platforms? I should be able to. But I have to try not to fall off. And lo and behold... Oh, oh, there's another one. Now lo and behold... Oh, wait. Now lo and behold... There's the next laser. Now it's going this way. How many of these things are there? Okay, that's where I did all that stuff before. Oh, right, right. I should just follow the path as normal. Wait a minute. Oh, I see what I need to do. I'm gonna need to hyper shot that. If I do that, then I have to get back up. Which, thankfully, I can just go this way. Hold on, that's that's not for where I need to go. Am I even going the right way? I think I need to get up there. I thought I was... need to get up to where the force field was. Maybe that's the last one I gotta do. Well, that's where I started, I think. Yeah, this is definitely where I started. Alright, let, let's take a look at this for a moment. It's linking here. I don't see a blue light here. And again, you can't see the blue light for any of them. Where does it not connect anymore? Because when you're in the map mode, you can't see the blue laser at all. So I'm getting a little help there. Let me try going this way again. Ah, jeez. I wish the laser didn't do that. I 
wish the camera could stay more focused on when the right asteroid is. I think I see it right there. Actually, I think there were two of them, and I missed them both. Of course. That one's a bit tricky. So all this? Is that where I started? Yeah, because that's there's my ship. That's the last one. Unfortunately for me, I lost track on where I need to go next. So now I might be going around in circles. Wish there was an easier way to see which satellite I have not touched. Because I feel like this map is not going to do me any favors. Maybe it's this one. Which is all the way up there. That one does not look blatantly obvious that I've touched. Oh yeah, it definitely wasn't this one. And that leads to the force field. The force field is now down. We did it. I guess there's more I need to do. We to Gemini Obani Gemini Pollux. Oh, there's another one of these. There, I destroy the wildlife. If you can call it that. At least it gives me lots of money. Money I'll eventually need for this. God knows, could be some new armor available later on. Eat it. Just eat it. All of you eat it. Give me money. Lots and lots of money. I want all that money. Uh, go up? I suppose we go up. Get another health upgrade. Oh, something down here. Glad I did that first. Huh. You can't go on top of the buildings. That's weird. At least there's no satellites I have to work with. Or do I? Actually, that's not a satellite. That's a fan to keep space cool. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> I wonder how many people flip their lids over that before they realize I said it on purpose. Do need the hell, so let's take it. Yes, I need the hell, so I'll take it again. Oh, that's just plants. 
This guy was like none the wiser. He has terrible uh, peripheral vision. Man, these guys are utter shit. Totally dominating uh, this Pollux area. Uh oh. Please don't do that. I know it's a bit reckless to just go in there John Rambo style. But hey, when have I always done the smartest thing? Maybe the reason you guys still stick around is because even though I don't do the smartest thing, I somehow still survive by the seat of my pants. When I have no business doing so. And you're just waiting for that one day where I crumble. <laughs> Give me some more of that lava love. What's it power at now? Okay, increased power, acid and lock on mod enabled. Okay, well, I need 1500 experience for level 5. As long as it doesn't become what it became in going commando when it leveled up. A slightly worse weapon. I'm all for it. See, I'm having a much better time when I'm not stressing out about getting all the skill points. Just the ones I probably could get if I tried. You didn't die in one shot to that? Really? I don't know if just hitting the building caused it to have, like, a second chance to not die. Cover me! Oh, man down! It's alright, Skid. The fight's over. Yes! I mean, no. That blows, man. I would have been here sooner, but I, uh, I encountered some heavy-duty resistance. Enemy troops? Well, uh, not exactly. The drive through it. Galaxy Burger was wicked slow, and... Anyway, looks like that last moon is surrounded by an Omega-class disintegration field. Whatever's going on out there, it can't be good. If I had the right tools, I could hack into that generator and shut the field down. Hey, lucky for you dudes, I brought this. Stand back, bro. I'm like a trained professional and stuff. Don't try this at home. Oh, man, it's busted. Oh, wait, never mind. Incoming call from the Galactic Rangers. Sarge, Blackwater City is under attack! The noise came out of nowhere. The situation is extremely, uh, it's, uh, well, we're, we're pretty much hosed, sir. Run for your lives! Ah! Sir, requesting immediate assistance! Whoa! Guess I'll be canceling that hoverboard trip to Blackwater City. The Rangers need our help. Let's go. Uh, I'll, like, catch up with you guys. I think this lock is gonna take a while. Okay, give us a call if anything comes up. You know what's going up? My blood pressure in dealing with this guy. There. I did it. Guess we can't do much else here for now. We're going to Blackwater City. I mean, we can still see her, but she can wait. At least I hope she can. You know, we could have just tried to land somewhere. Rather than have a missile land into us. But, you know, you do you, I guess. Well, I'll be glad to see you, Sarge. The noise 
Get ready for a major attack against our base. Incoming! And then I shoot at them. Alright, it's dog fight time. Even though we're not fighting dogs. We're not going down that territory. Alright, give more love to the lava gun. Sounds so wussy. We've dealt with this before. Yes, Tyranoids are gonna have reinforcements. They're fighting a war. You should be more disappointed if they're not. We trained for this, alright? Well, I mean, you guys trained for it. I just showed up. Why do you have your cover next to explosives? Ah, uh, it's gonna be like that, huh? to heal. Oh, I needed that just in time. Holy crap, I was getting bodied. How big is this dogfight anyway? Is it just like one round? Or like one part is just like constant wave after wave? I had a reputation? Oh, now we gotta do the bridge. Let's do it. Let's go, Sarge. We've got orders to neutralize the enemy forces guard. That bridge. I'm not listening to a word you're saying. Oh, I thought I hit that. Alright, I see how it is. You guys take care of these noids. I go get some money. Around us. The noise are storming the bridge. Why are you even whining so much about it? And they're walking through the barriers as if they're nothing. I don't die. Then don't just get good and you won't die. Not that hard. I say it's like constantly being shot at. Objective secure. We have captured the bridge. At least I'm healing up each time. <laughs> Counterattack. Sarge, somebody needs to get behind those noids and take them out. That somebody's gonna be me, right? It's always the one that's the playable character. Also, Gatling gun. No way, man. We're not 
going near that base until somebody puts those turrets out of commission. Are, did you say that sarcastically? Are you saying that I'm somebody that doesn't do their job? I don't like your tone, Sergeant. Or Cadet. Oh, it's hard to find good help these days. Oh, that was some fancy shooting, Sarge. Incoming. Here they come. This is a big one. You're not that big. I mean, look at that. Just wouldn't go on my lava gun, and they're pretty much toast. Good thing I'm a slow cooker set to low, because I think I should be taking out my bull pork by now. Well, it's not pulled now, but eventually it will be. Wait, you gave me gravity boots? That was a close one, Sarge. Thanks for the backup. I tripped over these gravity boots while I was running from the tyranoids. I believe they are your size. They play music when you get them too. Oh, apparently there was nothing to do in Blackwater City. Maybe a skill point, but uh, I'm happy that I got some gravity boots now. Oh, I could still play VidComic Episode 3 if I want to. We'll save that for later. But for now, I think it's time to go to Hollow Star Studios. Jeeves, activate the cloaking device. With pleasure, sir. Now you see us, now you... Oh, crud. Cut, cut, that's it. You've disgraced my set for the last time, kid. Take up basket weaving, you're fired. Get me the monkey. I'll see you at the trailer, Clank. Agent Clank, meet your new sidekick. <laughs> All right, forget the chase scene and go right to the grand finale. You did read the script I sent you. Uh, eh. First, you narrowly survive a series of death-defying stunts, yada yada. You defeat the terror of Talos, yada yada yada. Finally, you rescue the Baroness, played by the lovely Miss Courtney Gears. Okay. And action! All right, this is the part where you take out the henchmen, then chase Maximilian out of the bar. Try to make it look real, all right? Action! And cut. Next episode, we'll uh, continue on with this. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.